Hey guys, welcome back. In the last video we discussed processes, and in this video we're going to discuss services, which are a special type of Linux process. For the sake of this video, I've downloaded and installed uh, Elasticsearch from Elastic.co. I've tried different versions of their software, and I find that 1.7.3 works best for me. Let me just check and make sure I'm telling you guys the right thing. Yeah, 1.7.3 has worked the best for me on all Debian derivatives that I've tried it on. So if you have trouble with other versions, try installing this. They offer .dev and .rpm uh, for, uh, installers. We're not going into depth on Elasticsearch, but we're going to use this as an example for a service. And we're going to see services more in depth in the future as well when we install Apache uh, web server on the machine and you know use that. So we start a service by typing sudo service and then the service name and then the action we want to perform on it which is start. And we get no output but it did start and we can confirm that by going to Firefox here and going to the web interface of Elasticsearch, which is located uh, on port 9200 at localhost. And we see here that we are connected to Elasticsearch. So we can also stop the service in a similar way. And if we come back here, we'll see that it's unable to connect because we're no longer running that service. So a service is like a process, except you start it up and it kind of waits in the background until you need to use it, or it uh, can perform various tasks in the background. So they're helpful to have, and uh, they're lighter on the system when you're not using them. 